today's the day. Well, boy and I are gonna put the tiller together. Hey, they come with it as own tools. Ha, Mimsy's got some more tools. Cool shaft. All right. Uh, what you lay the instructions down for here? <laughs> That's probably what you're gonna need the most of. I say you're gonna need them opened. You got fuel mixing, Joe. All right. So maybe this will tell us what mix we need. Here, I'll take that. Set that right there. I'm so excited, y'all. <laughs> get it, get some of this out here. Cables and wires. Another handle. Oh, it's hung up in there. It's connected to the motor. Oh, well, too bad Amara's not here. She could play with the bubble wrap. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'll draw. Mm-hmm. Pack it by my feet. Okay. I'm nuts. I'm That's heavy. Get that. I can. All right. I'll lay it right here. We don't lose it. You may have to have it styrofoam to set this on. Okay. These tiller blades is already on it. Well, I've got to pull all the stuff on out to see. The other two handles are here. All right. I need to know what it looks like. Where the uh, bookie is. Here's the book. So he's gonna look on the instructions and we'll get right back with ya. So you want me to hold it just like that? Just kinda hold it against it so see how it's gonna rock over. Folks goes where really. I thought you read the instructions. <laughs> I said I thought you were reading the instructions. They don't give you a whole lot, they just Showing your parts. Oh, I did it. I just don't want to put the wrong boat in the wrong place and have to swap it out later. Right. I'll do it right. On the back is the number system. Oh, it's like a link. 
totally wrong on the mixing oil doing 40 to 1 or 50 to 1 the cap says <coughs> 30 to 1, 30 to 1. <laughs> nah. I don't think it hurt it just be a little richer yeah we don't want to be smoking <coughs> yeah we do it's two strokes Get on there and that'll help some okay. stabilize it. Or just don't <coughs> the wheel kit on. Yep. Yeah. They don't really give you great instructions on this at all. It's more kind of done by the pictures. <laughs> And they ain't really good. So we'll have to decide which is easier to put together, this or my rabbit hutch that we put together.
got the wheel kit there, but I'm unsure. I have to take a break and get puppy love. She needs attention. And now he does too. How this goes. <laughs> Doxy power. Okay. Want you two seconds of fame too. Oh. Ugh. Just go in here. I don't know which way. Dog germs. And it doesn't really show you. So this week we've got a couple of days that are going to be sunny and at least 60 degrees. Tomorrow is supposed to be 70 degrees. And this is January. This is not. Mm -hmm. There wasn't no more brackets in there. I'm not touching. No way. I didn't see it. Because actually, this bracket here on the picture. See it hollow in the center? Uh -huh. That is not. Hmm. And this one is. A mystery to be solved. So it's going to be good for learning how to use this tiller. Uh, it'll dry out some by tomorrow and I can pull back some of that ground cover in garden number one and till up and put some amendments in and then it'll be ready for spring. I'll cover it back up. This here, I don't know what that is yet. <laughs> but don't go on here, I don't think. Unless that's something to do with the rowing and I don't know what you would do with it. You know what I'm saying? You know, to kind of cut up. For dropping seeds? Groove in the dirt. Mm -hmm. Like a furrow. Yeah, make some so, rut to do your seeds and uh -huh. you drop it in here and set it at the right height with a pin. Awesome. <laughs> but I think that can go in later. I ain't sure on that. I gotta get that out or turn it up okay. to get, let me find out what boat this on though. If I like this thing, there'll be more brown turned up around here than <laughs> he wanted. My mind is going with projects. We could have done this as a live stream. Mm. <laughs> Turn it up somehow or another. Okay. Kind of heavy. I don't know if you can set the front kind of a little bit right there and go like that. Oh, see. I guess it matters which way it stays in there. Maybe it does. Well, it was just a thing. Maybe I did that right. Once it's seated, it should be okay. Keep one hand to hold back to the back. Hold what up? Just hold it in the back boat. So I can get that in there. Okay. Get this in a minute. And then you can do it with small hands. Teamwork makes Anna's dreams work. I'm so excited. I get excited about tools like I do seeds. Oh my God. Good. I'm going to go get some tools because I don't think this is going to be the I don't think. <clears throat> Y'all probably don't know this about poor boy, but he can fix just about anything he puts his mind to. All but a pink Mustang. <laughs> And he's gonna get that rolling too. He's been out there with modeling clay, taking impressions and everything else. He'll get it going. Probably gonna end up in a shop with a motor job. The way it's looking. 
Well, I won't fault you for that because when I actually do purchase green a large greenhouse, I'll have to hire somebody to come in and put it together. <laughs> so, uh, you can have your mechanic and I'll have my contractor uh, my, or whatever. It's a motor job. It's got to have... It'd have to have block work, so we'd have to go to a machine shop. I'm tightening this down like I got it just the way it needs to go. So hopefully it is? Hopefully. It's really deceiving. Uh, this right here, I know you guys have a hard time seeing that, but you pull out here, that'll lower your wheel set. Oh, okay. To, so your wheels won't, so your tiller, ever how deep you want my teal, right. you set your wheel depth for your tiller blades. I want it See, I got it all the way up now, so yes. it's I want whatever it, I want it preset so that it digs the deepest it'll go. You do that. Because I really only want to soften that ground. Hold out, and that's supposed to slide down. Okay. Supposed to. Well, you probably can't get enough leverage on it This right goes now. up. It's all the way down. So. Awesome. This so, will, if you raise the wheels, it'll, go up. It'll, it'll make the tiller part deeper. Is that what you're telling me? Yeah. Okay, then raise it all the way up. So that's all the way up. You got deep. full depthness. Oh, yeah. What you mean? I want full depthness on your first thing. Oh, yeah, I do. It's in the garden that's so, already been tilled. And I want to be putting right now. nutrients into the soil and my compost. So, it needs to go really deep. So that his roots go hunting it. But for now, we'll leave it right there. All right, let's get it up off of here. I'll set it on the floor. Okay. We'll be vacuuming today. So you till them, you till them a little bit right there where it's at. Yeah. It's Probably an inch or two, maybe. It's gonna have to be set up different. For sure. But you gotta roll it like this. Gotcha. I need that. I need a... We need the other handles on there. No, I need a flatter piece to put on those blades so they don't, the weight don't sit on them and bend them because okay. they're not very thick. Um, <laughs> Just there piece was that. a piece of cardboard in here, I think. Just something that or a piece of styrofoam. That'll work. Ooh. Let's see if this works. That'll work. Just leave it thick. Okay. There you go. That'll work. Maybe I won't bend them. Okay. All right. Let's see. Uh, give me that handle there. And it's going to go over here. Supposedly. Maybe inside. No. All right. Let me go outside. But it ain't going to right. That's it. All right. Hang on. Mm -hmm. Some blades here. Hey, it's a good thing I'm short. This is definitely a mini size tiller. Here, there you go. That's fine. There you go. Yeah, I'm trying to make sure that boat square part of that boat goes in the handle. Okay. There we go. Right. These washers are shaped. And you put the round part over that handle. Okay. So when I get through using this each time and I clean it up good, can I park it in the bedroom? No. <laughs> Told me I couldn't put my slicks in there. <laughs> he wanted to bring his tires for the bus thing in the house. I told him no. <laughs> back, years from dry rotten. <laughs> back years ago when Hurricane right. Katrina came through and a day before or the day after what was it when we finally got the generator in that we ordered Friday after it was after uh, Katrina but we had went through three weeks of no power and water and stuff and we finally got that generator 
I made him put it in the house, in the closet, and I dared anybody to touch it. That was my baby, because I didn't want to go through that again. It was awful with two little kids, and we were not prepared at all. We knew nothing about prepping for stuff like that. We weren't expecting it at all. Uh, we just knew it was a storm, and wasn't expecting it to blow up like it did. So That's part of what drives the prepper in me. This is the PTSD from Katrina. We don't want to put the tiller one, in the bedroom. <laughs> one in the tie tie. No, they sent to you. Zip ties to the rescue. Don't do it so tight that it can't move. Huh? So don't do it up so tight that it can't move. With the. Mm -hmm. I'm just kind of looking to. See how they had it run. Yeah, don't pull it so tight. I am. We got plenty of slightly go of it. Yeah, I really don't want it jerked away from there because it exposes the wire when you do that. So a lot of slack. Looks like they came, yeah, that's what I said. Looks like they came around it. Huh? Yeah. I said, yeah. Tight right there. I am, but I didn't want it pulling away from there. Yeah. This is the same stuff we used on the Mustang to cover wires, isn't it? Except for we used a larger, lesser gauge coil. Lesser gauge coil. You know, the lower the gauge, the larger something is. And so on your cover, we have larger. Oh. As long as it's not where it's going to be slapping against something, it should be okay. And if something happens and you've messed up and you have to cut that tie, I've got more. They're just longer and we just cut them off. Really like that. Well done. Yeah, because that's going to hit the motor, isn't it? It might get hot and melt. I'm just going to hold it up there, but I just don't, that's a lot of slack that I don't really like. Well, I can always turn it around this way and take another tie that I have and do it like that. So Either way Don't worry goes. about that. I can get it out of the way. I'm going to have to cut that one. Turn it around. I mean, I don't like that the way that looks with those mm -hmm. scissors. That's that the long bolt. Huh? That's the long bolt that fell out whenever we were. Ain't no more bolts. <coughs> don't know where that went. Yeah, I don't. No, I guess we'll have to find that. That's, that's a mystery. It'd be serious if something's loose in there and crank the motor and. It's possible. Yeah. Anything's possible. Well, that plastic sleeve is just a covering for protection and rust, I guess. Well, yeah, but I'm just saying. The wire cold, color code was weird. And I really need some light. Okay. Can't see too well. Let's see here. If we can get your flashlight up. Where it connects to. Okay. Oh, hang on, that goes. I have to redo those. Now that I see where it goes, it's <laughs> gonna be good. I'm gonna break those little wires. Oh, I don't want you to either. <laughs> My toy. Can I come in like this? But is it gonna get too hot against this and melt? Shoot. Okay. I can tie tie it over here, I guess. Somehow or another. Okay. I can't really. So well, that's the good thing about having that much slack. We can move it and adjust it once it's there. No. 
exactly how that hooks. Naturally, they don't show you. Naturally. What y'all finding? Y'all finding styrofoam on the floor? Okay. Go get on your bed. Gus, go get on your bed. Okay. Oh, I know where it goes now. Oh, goodness. One of them deals. Okay, but I don't know why. It's like that. I don't know why it's turned. They didn't send a, a flat screwdriver with a bunch. No, they just sent this weird thing. So how are you supposed to turn that? Oh, okay. It does it itself. All right. See how you're seeing any. I'm not really. <laughs> you're just feeling your way through it. For the most part, yeah. That's tight quarters in there for fat hands. Well, if you'll show me what to do, I can probably do it for you. Probably. I won't guarantee it. Not yet. You know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get that started somehow or another. That light ain't really doing no good. Well, you said you weren't using it, so I kind of moved out of the way. <clears throat> See what I need to do here. Yes, yeah, that's fine loaded, but it's not. Tough little dude to get to. I can't see. Nothing that I need to do. It needs to come up and go on that slot and hook. Okay. Cool. It's not working. Push it back the way you had it or I can get my finger on it. It ain't a matter of just pulling up because you can't no, see when you get your hand. Thin. You can't see when you get your hand in there. You'll have to move your hand now. I got hold of it. You hold a lot. Let's see. So I can get the hook. You have to bend it to put it in there. Is that what you're telling it's me? It's got to be straight up and down. It's got, I mean. But it goes in that hole, right? It goes in that silver part. Well, that nut is part of the problem, isn't it? No. The bottom one is. This one. Yeah, but you can't take it off. I'm gonna slip it down where I can get my fingers in there to work. And it goes in the hole, correct? It goes through that slot, not there. Not there, that silver part up here. See it slicing that one right there? Right here. <coughs> well, I'm trying to see, but I can't see. Right above your thumb, straight above your thumb. Oh, so it just feeds straight you through go, there. Yeah, but you gotta pull it up high enough to get it. Okay. The little lip to hook in the top and then put it in that slot which it ain't cooperating mm -hmm. just gonna get my fingers on it one more time <laughs> and that's turning on us and that's part and of the problem to. yeah but you don't have it in there you're feeding it straight through right. you don't need it to turn but it's gonna swivel i ain't no way of stopping that Almost. I almost had it. 
it needs like tweezers or something so I can pull it up just up here. It's a little bit of slack, but I'll tell you what, let me do. Let me, let me, let me do something. Hang on. Wait, just I got stop. it. Did it no, no, you missed it. Hang on, hold that. Turn that light off for a moment. I'm fishing to do something. I'm fishing to modify, adapt, and overcome. <laughs> Maybe. See, I know you can fix anything you put your mind to. It is just like a fraction of a millimeter short. Fixed yet. It will be. I have faith in you. I'll drink my coffee and relax. Yeah. Now, I don't think that had helped any, probably. But we'll see. Well, I, I can hold that loose while you. I need some slack. Just hold it. I Do you don't need the flashlight again? Yeah. Other parts before other tools. Adam wrenches. Oh, uh, take your. Uh, I see the fuel tank and all has Adam wrenches. Uh, this has Adam wrenches, so that's for if you ever have to take those off. And this one that looks like a plug wrench. Mm -hmm. Take spark plug out of it. Gotcha. I knew you would know about these things. A mechanic to understand that terminology of now, you know, talking so much when you're trying to do something because it takes your mind off of what you're doing. I know that you're wanting to um, go to the racetrack today, but you know I need some gas and mix and all right. <laughs> Try it out. I ain't got none. Let's go buy me some. My God, damn. <laughs> get more. That thing's never gonna get tight away. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I don't guess. I don't want to get loose. It's still loose. Mm, something else I'm gonna need is looks like a crook neck funnel to put gas in it. Yeah, that's kind of a weird deal. For sure. I don't know why they put a lid on it crooked like that. That don't make sense, but it's probably made in Taiwan or something. <laughs> Who knows? Oh no. I know this little boat going to get tired. I know that. It's made crazy. in China, that explains it. I guess the whole thing is turning. Cover right there is in the way. Should have been took off, I reckon. I thought about that earlier, but I was like, well, he'll do it if he needs to. <laughs> he didn't want to interfere that much. Now, this is a tight little place to have to work. I kid you not. I'm gonna take all that off. Is that a filter? Yeah, air filter. guys he's about got it together so we're gonna wrap this video up for today this is one of the things that happens at poor boy homestead he has to work for Mimsy <laughs> we have to do Mimsy's garden right so in a future video you will see us using the mini tiller that he bought me for Christmas thank y'all for watching <laughs>